Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a shopping haul. This is all the stuff that I've bought over the past couple of weeks. I'm going camping tomorrow and I'm going on holiday in a couple of months so I've been buying bits and I'm also including some beauty as well. Please like, comment and subscribe and I hope you enjoy the video. First I'm going to do beauty. I popped into Superdrug and I picked some bits up. I thought because I'm going camping I'm not going to be probably not going to be wearing much makeup anyway so I've bought some makeup remover wipes these are just Superdrug's own brand the vitamin E facial cleansing wipes and these are just to wipe my face with at night because I'm not going to have a lot of time to sit and do my full skincare routine while I'm in a tent so that's why I picked these up and then I also got the vitamin E hydrating mist and you will have seen this if you're on my snapchat because I've showed this on a few snapchats and what I've done is it actually looks like I've used loads but the spray it's like a water pistol it's so strong so what I've done is I've got um, a spray bottle from Superdrug and I just filled it up with the spray and this one's a lot finer so it doesn't shoot you in the face I also got some dry shampoo, this is the Batiste dry shampoo and I saw that this is a new one and it's the rose gold one and I buy anything that says rose gold so that's why I got it and um, and I bought this because when you're camping you don't want to be washing your hair every day. It kind of smells like that Charlie spray that everyone had when they were younger, that's what the smell reminds me of but I didn't smell it before I bought it so oh i forgot to say prices of those uh the spray was two or three pound i think the bottle that i put it in was like one pound fifty i think the wipes were about two pound and the dry shampoo was about three pound something like that and then i'm going to go on to what i bought from beauty bay firstly i got a big version of the cover effects illuminating setting spray I got a bigger version because I've got a travel size bottle and I, I bought that just to try it out to see what it was like and I love it so I bought the bigger bottle and this was £22 and I absolutely love this it's got like glitter particles in it and not everyone would like that but I love it because it makes your face look so glowy because it's little bits of glitter all over your face but it's not too intense it's not too obvious it's nothing too glittery and in your face so bought a big version of that I also got a couple of new brushes. I got the Morphe M433 brush, which is like um, it's like a flat blending brush for crease work. And then I also got the Morphe M505 brush, which is more of a blending brush. And this one's a bit more, sh it's a bit shorter than what I normally use. And I wanted this for a bit more, again, defined work in the crease so i got some new brushes i also got some bits for the giveaway but i'm not going to include them in this video because i'm going to include them in the giveaway video and i also got some new eyeshadows from makeup geek and i put them in my z palette i got the shades let me just check i got the shades bake sale which is this one here and corrupt um just to add to my z palette it's nearly full by the way i think i'm going to do a full dedicated video to my z palette so let me know down below if that's something you'd want to see and then you also got six freebies if you spend over 50 pound i think it were on beauty bay and i'm giving three in the giveaway and i'm going to keep three myself because i thought why not include them in the giveaway as well they're just little sample sizes of things so for myself i'm keeping the Mario Badescu Gly Glyconic Acid Toner. There's a little Beauty Blender Solid Cleanser, and I've also got the Glycolic Foaming Cleanser by Mario Badescu, and these are all sample sizes. Um, now I'm going to do shoes. I've got these ones from TK Maxx. Um, they were £15, and they're just a bit different. The sliders, but they've got like this chain detail over them with like fabric woven through the chains and I just thought they were a bit different and I like them for my holiday. I also just got a pair of flip flops from Primark, these were only 90p and they'll do for just on the beach and around the pool or whatever. I just got some little pink ones and then I also got these from Primark, these are also sliders and these are like a peachy pink colour, a bit more of a flesh tone and they've got little birds and flowers embroidered onto them 
and these were eight pounds and I'm also a size three tiny feet and then I'll show the things I got from Primark next I'm just looking at my phone because I've got the list of how much things cost on my phone first from Primark other than the shoes clothing I got this top which was six pounds and it's just like a bandeau top and it's got this like red frill around it but at the minute I'm really liking red I don't normally wear a lot of colour but I think I'm liking red at the minute next this is probably my favourite item that I got I absolutely love these I actually went back to try and get them in black but they said that they didn't have them and that they weren't getting any more black shorts in um, so these are just a pink pair of shorts and the denim and they're all ripped and distressed and they just look like that at the back and that at the front and um, these are a size 6 and I just thought they were so nice they were £10 and they fit me so well I find with shorts you get that bit at the back that sticks out well these don't do that at all they fit me so well I honestly couldn't ask for a better pair of shorts for the fit they fit amazingly and they're so nice as well I cut the tag out of the back because it was itching me so bad but other than that I can't complain they're so nice I also got some pyjamas these weren't in the pyjama section but I'm going to use them for pyjamas and I think they could be used for pyjamas they're not matching either but they go together I got this Beauty and the Beast top and I got a size 6 and this was £6 and it's just got Beauty and the Beast on the front and then I also got these shorts these were also Beauty and the Beast but these are like grey and black and a bit more like plain rather than colourful but I thought they'd go perfect and I also got those in a 6 but I would say that I wish I would have got these in an 8 because they are a bit tight the shorts were £6 as well I also got another bandeau top this one's just a plain white one and it's just got black lines across it but you can't really see it that well I got a size 4 in this one because it is stretchy and this was £4 and that was everything I got from Primark so now I'm going to show some shorts that I got from Miss Selfridge these are the shorts they're black ripped shorts because I tried to get some shorts from Primark the same as the pink ones but black and they didn't have any so I ended up looking everywhere and the only place I could find them was Miss Selfridge and these were £30 and that's why they were so expensive because I couldn't find them anywhere else but they are really nice they've just got like some rips down the front not as much as the ones from Primark and these are high waisted as well which I prefer high waisted shorts and jeans and these are the back and they're just some really nice shorts these fit well as well the Primark ones fit better but I would say that they're alright too and I got those in a size 4 next one pretty little thing I got this top and it's like a sheer it's sheer on the sleeves and sheer in the back and it's got this little tie at the bottom where you can adjust how tight the front bit goes this, this little tie bit down the front you can adjust how tight that goes and I got that in a size 4 and that was £12 and then I got this from Pretty Little Thing and it's a white bodysuit with a lace up front and obviously you can adjust how tight they go and I got a size 4 I believe and that was £15 and then moving on to Depop I bought these next lot of clothing that I'm going to show I did buy a few different pieces but there's still two things missing from this order but I thought I'd film it anyway seeing as I'm going camping tomorrow so this video will probably be up while I'm camping but I wanted to film the video before I went so I just didn't include those tops but it's just two white tops anyway one ties at the front and it goes around and they're both long sleeved and the other's a bandeau style top with like the strapless and then long sleeves again these next bikinis that I'm going to show are from Depop and the seller's name is let me just have a look the seller is at Alicia Gardner X on Depop and she's so nice she helped me with all the sizes and she told me what sizes she thinks would be best from what I told her from like my sizing and stuff and she got it bang on because they fit perfectly and I'm still waiting for a top from her but she told me that it was going to be a bit longer but the bikinis have arrived and they're really good quality as well I got a red one and these are the bottoms for it they're quite a revealing bottom but they're not like thong or anything and this is the top for it 
it's just a triangle top with adjustable straps which is really important because I'm only tiny so I have to adjust the straps and I got this in a medium the top and bottoms were both a medium because you could only choose one you couldn't choose a separate size for, for your bottoms and top so I got mine in a medium and yeah it's just got a clasp at the back and then it's just a little triangle top and it's not padded but it is really nice and it is really flattering as well and then the second bikini that I got from the same seller is this white one and it's a white bandeau bikini and these are the bottoms the really high bottoms they come really far up your hips but they're really flattering and then it's it's quite a high bum as well but again it's not a thong it's just quite a revealing bum and then the top to that is this one it's just a plain bandeau top and I got these in a size small because I didn't want to get a medium and the bottoms be too big so I got a size small and the top is a bit tight but it does fit and I would rather have a bit too small of a top and the bottoms fitting than too big and this is the top and I've tried them on and they fit perfect and then this isn't off Depop but they do have a Depop account they've also got a website as well and I purchased these off the website at CMX Clothing on Depop and I believe they've also got an Instagram account as well, which is CMX Clothing. And the, the website is also cmxclothing.com. And they have some really nice stuff. And I ordered one top from this CMX Clothing and then one top from the Depop seller. But neither of them have arrived yet. But one swimsuit that I ordered from the CMX Clothing has arrived. It's quite hard to show you on camera. But it's one of those where it's got really long straps and you can customise it yourself and make it how you want it to look. And that's good because I'm too small for swimsuits. So if I can customise how long the straps are going to be, then that's perfect for me because it means they're going to fit better. So it's just this like khaki colour. Um, and it's again not a thong, but it's got a really low back and then a plunging neckline. And then the way I do it is I tie it around my neck and I pull it round under my arms and I tie it around my waist three times and tie a bow at the front and again this is really flattering and I think it's really pretty on and it fits amazing again and I got the smallest size in this but I can't remember which one it is I also got this jumper it's from USC and it's a Tommy Hilfiger jumper but it was half price I think it was um, £32 I think or something like that and it's just got a pocket all the way through and it says Tommy Hilfiger down the sides here, down the pockets. And it also says Tommy Hilfiger, like it's got the sign there, but the sleeves are too long, so I have to roll them up so you can't see that anyway. But it was half price anyway. And I was going to get the matching tracksuit bottoms, but they didn't have my size. And they were also half price. This is everything I've got. And I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see any of the products more up close or in an upcoming video, just let me know down below. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next one.